today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make a Lego hedgehog. For those of you who don't know what that means, it's basically one of these thingies. I got two of them. And I'm going to show you how to make one. If you give me a minute to take it apart. Okay. So the first thing that you're going to be needing is a, what I like to call vault door technic piece. Technic standard piece. And then one of these. And one of these. It's not going to work if you don't have those pieces. If you don't have those pieces, then you're basically screwed. And then this one goes in the way of the Technic Circle. And this one goes in the way of the Technic Cross piece, if it will fit in. I'm only recording this with one hand because I can't find my stand. And then you're going to need, like, uh, hold on, let me count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 of these little Technic Standard whatever pieces. And then, since you need 12 of those, you're going to need 6 brown studs. And what you're basically going to do for 4 of them, you're going to take 4 of them like this and put the- Hold on, bear with me for a minute, folks. You're going to take the- That was not intentional. You're going to take these two. You're going to put them together like that. And then put this little stud here. So, and then you're going to need, and then you're going to put them on, like, this way. Actually, you're only going to need two of these. Sorry, I lied. You only need two ones like that. And then the rest are going to be the same build, like, with that. Except you put the stud on the opposite side. And put them right there. And you need four of those. One, two... Three. Four. And then you have your basic Lego hedgehog. So I make these for my D-Day movies. They look great. I mean, you know, throw in a bunch of... Um, I don't know where I put my... Yeah, just throw in a bunch of minifigures. And you can use them in your, like, your war thingy. And what works really, really well with these is if you actually, you can make, like, a little gate if you, like, take your studs and, like, place them together like that. You can, hold on a second. If you uh, put them together like this, you can have a little, you know, like, a little gate thingy. Wrap some, like, uh, chains for, like, barbed wire or, like, you know, like a, like a, whatever, wrap it around here like that and it can be your barbed wire or whatever so um thanks for watching i hope this video helped you if you're making a d-day movie good luck <laughs> I, I i seriously wish you the best of luck i'm two years into mine i remember around here in february i was just or february i was um talking to my one friend will about making a d-day movie and then we were talking about pads and stuff and that's when i started making it it i'm two years and a half and I'm making it and I I haven't started filming yet I'm making the supplies I'm buying them I haven't like I'm looking for deals like I'm like making looking for bargains and um right now if you want to see how to build a Willy's Jeep like a like a, a, a DD landing boat craft here thing I'm still working on that or a half track without the track if you don't have track and then like a yeah like one of those or a, or a Willy's Jeep like that yeah cool like another half track with a cargo hatch in the back leave a like in the description and thank you so much for watching please hit a like button and subscribe hit a like button hit my like button and subscribe thank you for watching have a good day